Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to get 30 fr 20 to 30 frames more FPS than you would normally get. Uh, I was standing here earlier at 20 something FPS and I changed some settings around in the config and now I'm getting around 40 to 50 FPS. Right now I'm getting 20 FPS because I'm recording but uh, I'll be back with the configurations in a second. Okay, hey guys, I'm back with the configuration part now. What you want to do is go down to your documents folder, go to Arma 2 operations folder, or other profiles if you have more than one profile. Now go into your Arma 2 OA config what you want to do is go down to these four configurations, set them all to zero. It'll look slightly worse in game, but that's worth it for me with better FPS. And then after you set these VSync, FX, no, not FX, ATOC, PPAA, and PPA level all to zero, save the file and go to your profile config right here profile file file I use the notepad plus plus for this uh, what you want to do is go down a little bit like near the bottom uh, set your FOV to 0.75 and your FO5 level left equals 1.33 it doesn't matter about all the rest of these just delete those uh, now you go to something called mouse smoothing yes mouse smoothing set that to one that's the lowest setting that's usually what makes your mouse lag whenever you try to aim in uh, after that, what you want to do is just save this, exit, go in game, set everything to low and normal, and I'll be back with you there. Okay, hey guys, I'm back with the options that you need to set now. You go to video options, I, this doesn't make any difference in Daisy at all that I can see other than the very edge of the screen, so I keep that around a thousand. Uh, I usually set my full scale 100%, but I'm running in windowed right now. Uh, go to advanced texture, I keep that normal because that's just CPU intensive. Keep your video memory at default, or else it will use a forced video memory, which will not be your full video memory if you have more than a gig or 500 megabytes. Keep this at low, I keep this disabled. Uh, terrain detail, I put low, it just it's just a bunch of grass. Uh, object detail is also grass and terrain. Uh, shadow, I keep that normal. It only 2 FPS bump, which I can handle. Keep my HDR and quality normal. Disable post-process effects and interface size, I don't think that matters, just however you prefer that. And the last thing is you need to disable vSync, so you get the full frames per second out of your computer. Or out of the game, I should say. Okay, uh, that is it. Now you can enter the game and test out the settings. Uh, if you're wondering how I did this, I'll set, I'll, I'll give you the uh, codes for it in the description so it will load a lot faster in the game. Uh, that's it I guess. Uh, please comment, rate, or subscribe if you can and I'll see you guys later.